Hello everybody, Don't Blink here again with a Counter-Strike Global Offensive gameplay commentary for you guys. I got access to this beta today thanks to Twitter user Dane Trooper, so thanks Dane for that. And I wanted to make a video of it because <laughs> I've been excited about this game. I always wanted to get good at Counter-Strike Source. I played many, many hours of that game when it first came out. And uh, I never really got the hang of it. So I've been looking forward to this game, hoping that I would have a little bit more luck in terms of getting the hang of the gunplay and stuff like that in this game. And thankfully, I seem to take to it a bit better than I did Counter-Strike Source. I was always kind of confused by the hitboxes in that game. And there you can see I just still don't have a handle on the ballistics and the spread mechanic in this game, but I'm getting the hang of it. I mean, this was just within the first 30 minutes or so of me playing, but yeah, uh, the hitboxes in Source, I never really understood how exactly they worked. They weren't 100% accurate. Um, and what I, mean, what I mean by that is, you know, you would see a player and their hitbox would be like behind them or in front of them or just in weird spots, spots you wouldn't expect the hitboxes to be in. And for that reason, I was never really good at hitting my targets. Um, and that's not the only reason. I'm just bad at this game in general. But that certainly didn't help. And in this game, the hitboxes seem to be very accurate and actually reside on their players. So obviously, that makes a lot more sense to me, at least. And I find it much easier to actually aim at and hit my targets. And as a result, I was having a bit more fun playing this beta today than I really ever did while playing Counter-Strike Source. So I'm looking forward to this game, for sure. And for those of you who are big 1.6 or Source fans and are worried about whether this game is going to be any good or not, uh, I wouldn't worry, personally. You know, I, I was never very good at 1.6 or Source, like I said, but this game does feel... A lot like Source in terms of the movement and um, the weapons and the aiming mechanics and the recoil and all that. Uh, it just seems a lot more modern. Obviously, the graphics were quite nice, at least on this map that I was playing on. And uh, like I said before, the hitboxes seem to make a little bit more sense. So if you really like Source's hitboxes, and I don't really know why you would, but if you really like <laughs> Source's hitboxes, then you might not like this game. But uh, I think that it's definitely true to the franchise. You know, you can't aim down sights on weapons that you formerly couldn't in previous Counter-Strike games. You know, there are weapons with scopes, and you can aim down sights on those. But all the other weapons, you still hip fire, and... I don't know, it feels like a Counter-Strike game, but it feels smoother and more polished and newer, and it definitely looks better. Uh, in this video right here, I was actually playing a new game mode that they're introducing in Global Offensive called Arsenal Demolition. It's actually uh, based very loosely on gun game. Basically, the counter-terrorists uh, have to prevent the terrorists from planting and um, detonating a bomb. So there is bomb planting in this mode, but there is no equipment or weapon buying at the beginning of the round. Instead, at the start of each match, you start with either an AK or an M16, depending upon the faction you're playing as. And if you get a kill uh, in a life, then you will actually be demoted to a worse weapon. <laughs> so you'll go from the AK or the M16 down to the P90 and then to the Deagle, um, so on and so forth, just to worse and worse weapons. And uh, if you get more than one kill in a round, then it'll start ranking you up and giving you grenades. So you'll get a frag, and then a flash, and then an HE, so on and so forth. So it's it's very interesting. It's um, You don't really have to worry about cash management or anything like that. You just are given a gun at the beginning of each match or each life, and you have to work with what you have. <laughs> so it's, it's interesting, and I really enjoyed playing this mode, it was fun. I've never been good at managing my money in this game. So not having to worry about that and instead just worrying about the objective and, and getting kills and staying alive, it was fun and it was uh, a good introduction to this game, I have to say. 
So yeah, thus far I'm really excited about Global Offensive. This was a nice little situation where I think there were two enemies left and I didn't have much health, <laughs> so I kind of had to camp like a little bitch, but um, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do and in this game I feel like it's not really frowned upon to uh, play in that way. And You know, I was, I was right next to the objective, so it's not like I was being a, a total dickwad, but anyway, yeah, I'm looking forward to this game. I think it's going to be good. Let me know if you've played this game, what you think of it. And even if you haven't played it just yet, uh, if you're a long-time Counter-Strike fan, let me know what you think of this game and whether you think it's going to be uh, a worthy successor to Source. And that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one. Bye.